Hello Kids Rockers! I'm just sending out this video for those of you that um, volunteer for Kids Rock. I so appreciate you as does Matt and all the parents that you serve and children that you love on at Awake Church. Okay, just a few things. Please, if you could, be at church at 9.50 a.m. on your day to volunteer. If you look at the schedule, and please look the schedule over, and you see a date that you cannot volunteer, something is, is on your schedule, if you could let me know as soon as possible so we can get that all worked out. You've been so good about that. I really appreciate it. Um, our schedule of events, except for on Art Sundays, are that we worship, we have snack, we use the restroom. Let's just talk about the restroom for a minute. When we go to the restroom, we want to try to help the children to be as quiet as possible. And both men and women are to stay in the doorway, door propped open, and allow the children to go to the bathroom. We don't use the family bathroom for any reason. We never go in a family bathroom with a child one-on-one. -on -one. We never spend time with a child one-on-one -on -one at, at church at all. So that's just a little bathroom procedure. Remember, you want to check and make sure no kids are left in the bathroom when we leave. Okay, no kids should be going over and getting mints over at the Welcome Center. I just say that's something that you do with your parent, you know, because parents aren't wanting all that sugar intake. Okay, we'll come back upstairs after bathroom break, and we'll have a prayer. Um, and then we'll do Bible Rock Reading. Remember, Bible Rock Reading is their homework. And so they each get a gem for doing their homework. They put their homework in the hat, and then we pull out a winner, and that person picks a prize from the prize drawer. From there, we go to um, Bible memory verse. But let me just say, after we pray, we go over the rules. So the rules are even before Bible rock reading. Okay, then we've got Bible memory verse and PowerPoint. If they're ages five, six, and seven, they can say the short, like, three-word PowerPoint, and we can help them with that. The Bible memory verse, though, I would like the kids to be able to say the whole Bible verse and the address of where that verse is found in the Bible, and they all get a coin for doing that portion. Remember, then they stand on the, the number of their choice, number one through six. We roll the dice, and those winners get a gem. Okay, then it's time for sharing whoever the main speaker is that day, and then a game. We have a new procedure at Kids Rock right now, and that is that not only are we doing stickers, parent has a sticker, child has a sticker, but we're doing a clipboard. And on the clipboard it says parent's name, person picking up the child, are there any allergies? And the reason for this extra step is because we are having parents lose their sticker. And so... To prevent <clears throat> the child going home with the wrong person, and unfortunately in our world, in every church, there are people who are just in hard situations. Maybe there's a custody battle, maybe there's a divorce going on, and it's not that parent's turn to have that child. So we want to make sure we are not um, making a mistake there. So if a parent says, I have lost my sticker, then we say, could I please see a form of ID? If that is not the person's name as the pickup person, even though it might be a parent, they may not pick up that child that day. If anyone's giving you a hard time, we always have ushers, we have security in the lobby, and you can ask for help, but we've got to uh, be as careful with that as we can. Okay, um, we have a video coming out called Boundaries and parents will give the thumbs up if they want their children to watch this. It's all about appropriate and inappropriate behavior between a parent, adult, child to child. Okay, so what's appropriate behavior between parent and child, adult and child, child and child? And it's very kid friendly and we just want kids to be equipped um, for our world, pretty much. And finally, um, if you do hear of any abuse, physical, sexual, any abuse towards a child, we are by law to report that. Okay, so this is not a time, as you know, you know this, to be in the parent's corner. This is to, the time to be a child's advocate. So 
If you know anything or suspect something's going on, go ahead and go to Matt or myself and we will help um, get the right things in place for that child to be safe and to resolve a situation. So thank you so much for all you do. Make sure that you have a background check turned into me. Make sure that you, it is updated. It has to be updated every two years. And also know that CPR training is coming up soon. You are part of the backbone of Awake Church. Thank you so much for all you do. You are so appreciated.